Mm, Alice Springs, cool. <laughs> nice uh, umbrella stand there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, it's real deserty around there. I wonder what the. What if it's an umbrella corporation where they like are at the center of center of Australia because this is where this is, and it's like a secret underground facility where they like generate rain for for Australia and like build up ions and then blast them out and then that's the you know typhoons or something that they have. Yeah, it's a lot cooler of an explanation than whatever the hell was going on before. Obviously. They sort of ripped off this location for the Resident Evil movie. <laughs> just a little bit. A little bit. Yeah. Um, and, uh, oh, rest, yeah. yeah. Anyways. Oh, but also, I'm like, come on. Where's the implementation for Google Earth with your controller? Yeah. No version of Google Earth supposedly works with controller. But you see, they did show it off with a controller. Bill Gates himself... When Google Earth first became, like, you could zoom from one location to another, and he wanted it implemented into movies where you could use a controller as a nerd and smoothly transition over using Google Earth and, like, they put in clouds and stuff. They all worked it out. Then yeah. you could switch to a drone, you know, make it look like you're really zooming people, down. Quick. People did experiments with that on YouTube at different yeah. points to get different degrees of success. But it was amusing sometimes. They completely broke down Google Earth after 2012, so it's just unstable. So you can't, you can't use a controller ever, and you can't. You don't have any refined smoothly. controls where you smooth over places yeah. into some location. 